How you all doing? What we're going up to in this video? <laughs> it's MOT for the Dithy. So wish me luck. Oh, I feel a bit nervous. The guy right up my arse. I haven't ridden the bike since last November. It's now near the end of June. My riding skills are a bit rusty. It's forced me past 30. Stick my hand out so he knows where I'm going. I think I can beat the bus. Uh, can I just say a massive thank you to Paul and Colin because if it wasn't for, the, for their donation this MOT video wouldn't have been available as yet anyway. Not for a long time. So yes we're just about there at the uh, MOT station so wish me luck. So there we go. Do you think it passed or it failed? It passed with flying colours. Thanks again, Polly and Uncle, for the uh, generous donation, which more than covered the MOT cost. Thank you so much. Now I can go to Aldi's and get a bottle of Coke to celebrate. Sugar free, that is. Yes, you pass with flying colours, no advisories. It's a brilliant place to take your bike for an MOT, it only costs £25. And the guy is very friendly. Come on then. Let's go. Remember when I used to have those little owls on the back of my bike? Cool. That's going back a bit. That's going back a lot. Hell of a lot. So what are my afterthoughts about the Dibby since I rebuilt it in, uh, I think it was 2017? Uh, this is actually the fifth MOT I've taken it for. And it's passed everyone with no faults. 
But there's two things I hate about this bike. But let me just pop into Lidl's and I'll tell you when I get back. Not what we need decaf coffee, right? um, the gold one, isn't it? Is it? The gold one. That one, that gold one there, like the blue lid. Oh, that yeah. one's decaf. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, there we go. All done. What was I talking about? There's two things I don't like about the divvies. Well, I better not leave my coffee there, do I? What a div. Come all this way for coffee because I did not have any. And I'm going to leave it on the floor. Now then, where was I before I got rudely interrupted by my bad memory? Yeah, there's two things I don't like about the divot. Definitely don't like. Number one is the five gears, obviously. I prefer it to have six gears. And number two is when you're cruising about 50 miles an hour, so we're between 50 and 60. You get a vibration through your foot pegs. Well, you do on mine, but I've heard it is quite common. So, I'm going to do a video on that to try and uh, overcome it and sort it out. So, look out for that one in the future. So they're really the only two things I hate about this bike. Now I'm here, and now I'm here, and now I'm here, now I'm there. I can't stress enough how good it feels to be out on the bike again. The weather has cooled down out of a lot. I've got my bits of shopping and I'm just uh, got no particular place to go at the moment. Just riding round. Because I'm loving it. It's wicked. In fact, it's better than wicked. It's glorious. Amazing, outstanding, fantastic. Perfectly splendid. Wicked. Boring. enjoyed that little stretch back to the dirty 30 
Thanks again Paul and Colin for the donation and making this video possible. Oh blimey, that was hard stopping wasn't it? Safe and sound. I see you in another life, brother.